now that we got that out of the way, let's go ahead and move on towards um, whatever we have to go next. To save those paper toads and stuff like that. Should be pretty interesting. But yo, this block has lots of good stuff right now. Holy crap. Alright, now we can actually go over here. Oh, wait. <laughs> oh, hello. I've been tasked by Princess Peach to assist you in all of your journey. If you don't mind, I'm going to make some notes about your conversations, about our conversation to send back to her. That's not creepy at all. But okay. The subjects appear focused on the adventure ahead. So focused, in fact, that they nearly ran by this reporter without any acknowledgement. Yeah, because you're not important to our lives. This focus will surely come in handy for the battles ahead. Pretty cool. But perhaps I'm getting ahead of myself. We haven't even properly introduced. I'm Lakitu. Pleased to meet you. As I mentioned, Princess Peach has asked me to look out for you uh, and provide assistance as necessary. So I was just working on uh, my report to her. If you need me, rest assured I will dash over to your side. But for now, I will keep a respectful distance. Alright, I, I can respect that. One last thing. Be sure to save often, won't you? If you happen to ex um, exit your adventure without saving, you'll restart from a previous save point, And nobody wants that. Unless you, you know, rage and at like a boss fight and you want to start over. Then that might be useful. Anyway. Look, isn't that Mario? Oh my god. I don't know. Something seems different about him. Huh, you're right. Mario's a round guy, but not this round. I love how these just guys are just staring at me right now and just not expecting me to freaking kick them in the face. Why are y'all giving me that hairy eyeball? What the heck? Golly, get a load of this guy. Oh shoot, Starlo's gonna go world star on this guy. Hey, back off! Get your mitts off me! He's flatter than a pita- a pita pocket. Pita pocket. Yo. Yo, Starlo's already going to work with this roasting. That's my face you're folding. Those are my shoes you're crumpling. Ow, ow, ow! Quit it! <laughs> Jesus Christ, look at this man. He looks like a freaking origami. <laughs> uh, you okay there, buddy? Wow, he doesn't care. He don't care about your life. No, I'm not okay. Did you see the way they were manhandling me? Why would you say that? <laughs> I'm all bent out of shape now. Let's give these brutes a taste of their own medicine. Alright, first battle. Here we go. Ooh, the classic Mario Luigi tutorial battle music. Let's go. Mario, Luigi, when was the last time you battled? Uh, Like two years ago, I think? No, three years ago, because this game released in 2013. Anyway, or was it 2014? I'm not sure. It's been a while, right? So... Alright, so basically, she's, she's talking on the bottom screen. You should check out the battle guide. You can read all about the rules and controls for battle. After all, I'd hate to see these Goombas walk all over you. Good point, that would kind of suck. A new chapter has been added to the battle guide. Take a look at it by or any time by tapping the battle icon on the lower screen. Alright, but here we go, guys. We're going to finally get into some battles right now, and here are our options. We can actually use the jump, of course. We have the hammer. And then, what are you doing? Oh, they're telling me to use the guide. Oh my god. Alright. But, and then, the other one is using the item. So let's go ahead and actually jump on this, bro. The, jump on this little Goomba right now. Paper Goomba. Level 2. Oh my god. Here we go. Bam. And excellent. So basically, everything's about timing, guys. Like, with your jumps and everything like that. Just press the A button when you're right about to make contact with the Goomba. And you should be able to actually get rid of them a lot faster. So, Luigi's gonna get in. And there we go. Not bad at all. Oh, crap. I just dropped something. <laughs> Why is everything on my desk um, drop like that? Nailed it. Keep doing it just like that. Sounds good to me. Alright. And now that there's a little indicator right there, it's actually telling me... Oh, crap. Oh, I didn't think it would... Oh, I did not see that. A new chapter's been added to the battle guide. Alright, I don't need to check that out. Okay, let's do this again. I don't know why I got hit by that. Bam. Bam. Look at that crap. Get, get destroyed, dude. Get destroyed. Press B. Let's go. Bam. And get crushed. Not bad at all. Alright. And that is it. So, once we get enough experience to actually get all the way to the top of the flagpole, we can actually level up our characters and actually upgrade them to higher ranks. So, currently, right now, guys, at the start of the game, we start off as Mushroom Rank. So, pretty cool, I guess. You better watch yourself next time. I'm coming back with a whole stack. Ooh, I'm scared. Then we'll see who's uh, Crumpler and who's the Crump Lee. What the heck? That's so scary. Those goons were pretty flimsy after all. <laughs> we can't expect them everything to be a cakewalk. 
True, true, true. True, Mario. Right. Well, remember what Princess uh, Paper Princess Peach said? And if both versions of Bowser's minions teamed up, things could get pretty sticky. Good point. Oh, shoot. Yo, we got freaking Kamek over here. It's not Kamek, guys. I hear freaking people all the time online say, It's Kamek. This guy's name is Kamek. No, shut up. <laughs> Minion, what's the status of our plan of... Uh, wait, hold up. What's the status of that plan of ours? Ah, uh, yes, Master Bowser. The plan is, uh, truckering along. Trucking along. Oh, shoot. Yikes. What kind of progress report is that? Speed it up. Get it done. Yes, sir. Oh. And I want to nip this little Mario problem at the butt. Tell me the minions... Wait, tell the minions to hunt them down and destroy them. Sheesh, what a kill you to say, please. Well, didn't even have to do anything for that one. A thousand apologies, your highness. I was only talking to myself. Where the heck am I? I mean, where the heck am I? I already know who that is. Has his highness taken up, uh, ventriquiz wait, ventriquilism? Quism? I don't even know. I'm sorry, guys. My word! Oh, shoot. We got Paper Bowser! What the heck just happened? Hello? But, 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 but. Uh oh. Who the heck is this guy? My eyes must be playing tricks on me. Oh, wait, my eyes must be trying, pl tr playing tricks on me. There are two Master Bowsers? I don't know how you snuck in, but get the hell out of here. This is my castle, you flimsy knockoff. Oh, please. You're the knockoff. Even your insults are knockoffs. Get out before I rearrange your face. I'd like to see you try. Oh no! Oh shoot, they're getting into it, my boys! Oh shoot, it's smash time, if you know what I'm saying. Have a Hertz Donut paperweight! Ugh, black, that's nothing compared to my knuckle sandwich. Ow, stop pulling my hair, you lousy cheat! Coming from you, that's a compliment. <laughs> what? Master Bowser! Master Bowser? Oh my god, look what he did to his face, <laughs> holy crap. What is it, can't you see I'm busy? Uh, sorry to interrupt. I'll let you, uh, I'll let you get back to, uh, whatever you're doing. Oh, shoot. This man Bowser declares war with this man. Uh, uh, why you? Master Bowser is, uh, occupied at the moment. Can I help you with... Wait, can I help you? There's a flurry of flat toads and minions pouring down all over the Mushroom Kingdom. Say what now? A whole mess of paper things came flying out of Peach's castle. This is all starting to make some sense. I've heard about that book that holds a parallel world within its pages. I thought it was just the stuff of legend. But based on what you've told me, perhaps this book is in fact real. And it sounds like it, uh, it's in Princess Peach's castle. What's the big idea, copycat? Uh-oh, we, we got little baby Bowser. And that would explain this little situation here. Oh my god. What? It's pretty obvious that you're the copycat. That said, you picked a pretty nice style of Jack. Thanks! Well, they're pretty friendly acquainted. It's like looking into a fur... Oh, fur house. Fun house mirror. Crazy. But anyway, you showed up at just the right time. I was getting bored around here. The name's Bowser Jr. Pleased to meet you. No way! That's my name, too! Wow! Okay, then. Let's get this party started. What the heck does that mean? <laughs> my head is starting to hurt. <laughs> Jesus Christ, look at that flame. Oh, my lord. They're going in! Master Bowser, please calm down. Hey, can I get a little assistance here? Ow, 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 L leave me out of this. Yo, that's a that's a threesome right there. <laughs> Anyone else have a weird shivery feeling? I hope it's just as breezy and, uh, and not something more ominous. For now, let's just go rescue those paper toads. All right, sounds good to me, guys. So now, let's go ahead and actually get these coins right now. Get some blocks over here, too. That'd be really cool. All right, Mario, Luigi, Mario, Luigi, Mario, Luigi, and there we go. So, let's go ahead and explore right now. We're not really getting into the huge beef of this game, guys, but it will get a lot better, trust me. Like, only in the first hour, things get to, you know, really, really good, or at least a little bit more fun. But anyway, let's go ahead and do this once again, and get that as well. To open up the gate, and we can actually make our through way, wait, make our way through here. <laughs> But let me actually go ahead and see if there's anything else I should be, um, paying attention to. Nope, nothing here. So let's just go ahead and move on. 
So I'm probably gonna be playing this uh, first portion of the game for another like 20 minutes just because you know why not Oh my god. Hello. It's Mario. And it looks like the real deal this time Well technically speaking that other guy was real too, right? I mean sure he was flatter and it was just weird how he floated down from the sky But does that make him any less real? Anyway, whatever. Let's go get him Wow, you think you could just walk up to me and expect for me to actually just like pay attention? Whoa guys I just remembered something really important. When enemies are about to attack, you might notice a little funny uh, circle around your feet. You know what? Let me just show you. Alright, sounds good. Hey, would you mind attacking Mario? No offense, but you couldn't hurt a fly. That's why I chose you. Oh my lord, Starlo! You gotta chill, girl! You gotta chill. Oh my god. Hold it! Mario, look at your feet. When you see a red target like this, it means the enemy is aiming at you. Now's your chance to do what you were born to do. Jump! Alright. Oh god, okay, just barely got that. I was about to time that wrong, too. Stop! Don't take another step! Guys, look at your feet. Targets with dashes that like these means that either one of them could- Oh, what, either one of you could be attacked. You're gonna have to watch the enemy closely, right up to the last second. Alright. Oh crap, did not mean to do that. Did you catch that? If you're all set, we can move on. Or, we can totally talk about this enemy's secrets behind his back. I'm good, I'm good. Heh, I knew you two would get the hang of this quickly. Having a hard time figuring out what, who's being targeted? Well, you should try using assist. Turning it on takes the guesswork out of defense. Wanna give it a try? Yes, guys, I actually do wanna turn this on. All right, just press start to activate it. And it is on. Perfect, now let's see what changes things. So basically when we have a chance of, um, see that? When assist is on, you'll always know who's being targeted. You know what to do, Mario, jump. And that is how it is. Nicely done. Don't be shy turning on assist, um, don't be shy about turning assist on whenever you need a little help, okay? Trust me, assist is actually really helpful, especially in battles, so... Really glad that they actually introduced that in this game. A new chapter has been added to the battle guide, and we can check it out on the bottom screen. Alright, I'm actually going to be using my hammer for this little fight over here, since we never got to really use it before. And depending on how hard you time it, you can actually get either a good, great, excellent, or you can completely miss it. So, let's do this. And now it's perfectly charged! Ooh, get slammed! And now Luigi over here is going to freaking bop this boy. Mmm! Ooh, we got lucky one right there, and we killed him. Hey, not bad. Alright. Oh, crap. Dude, I almost failed completely right there. Alright, let's go ahead and jump on him for our last attack. Here we go. Bam. And excellent. There we go. That is it for the battle. Just getting started. We got plus five points right there. I don't know what that is, though. Hey, you just completed an expert challenge. Every time you complete an expert challenge, you'll earn points. And you can exchange these points for awesome new gear in the gear shop. Okay, I actually didn't even remember that part when I first played this, actually. Um, we can actually tap on the bottom screen, the top, uh, sorry, the bottom left, to actually check out um, the expert challenges and stuff. So that's pretty cool how we can actually exchange them for gear. I didn't even know that before. Alright, we got a lot of experience from that, too. Alright, now we can actually move on and see what else is going on here. I'm going to try to avoid battles. Um, whenever I can, guys. I mean, actually, no. I kind of... Let me take that back. I do want to do battles as soon as I can. Like, as much as I can. But I don't want to do battles, like, every single time we see one. Like, an enemy. Since, you know, it's kind of a little bit of wasting time to the main story. So, alright. Luigi, Mario, Mario, Luigi, Luigi. 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 Crap. I messed that up completely. Alright, that's fine. That actually was a little bit more difficult than I thought. But, you know what? It's all good. Uh, I'm not gonna... Oh, crap. I should have jumped or something. So we could actually... Oh, excuse me. All right. Let me just jump. What? Bruh! All right. Now we now we can jump. Okay, that was better. Let's do this right now. Freaking Mario. Mmm! Excellent! All right. Let's see what you guys can do to me. Actually, let's go ahead and uh, use the hammer. Why not? Let's go ahead and use it on this guy. Let's charge it up all the way. And slam. Not bad at all. So now... He's gonna go ahead and target me. See, like, look what I told you guys. Like, it's super useful to actually have the assist on because, I don't know, just having it off with the whole, like, randomly guessing who's gonna be attacking you is kind of like, I don't know, it's kind of ridiculous. But having the assist on is actually just really useful. I kind of recommend it. But we're gonna go ahead and land on this guy one more time just to finish him off. And there we go. And we got ourselves a mushroom from that, so. There we go. Got six experience right there. That is it for that battle. So, it's actually really useful also when you have those little, um, 
those heart bars that you guys saw a few or like 10 minutes ago to where we can actually use that to um, increase our HP and our bro points all the way. So pretty recommended that we do that. But now we're going to go ahead and see what's going on here. Nothing much is going on here. I'm just saying. But all my friends have been abducted by weird looking versions of Bowser's minions. And all my surroundings are so much more vivid than normal. What is going on? Oh, of course. I must be dreaming. What a relief. Okay. <laughs> Alrighty then. Hi there. Eek! That freaky yellow ball is talking to me. Um. Hold up. Wake up, self. Or at the very least, run away. Wow. You gotta treat Starlo like that. That's so messed up. Wait, come back. Alright, fellows. Looks like they're gonna have to catch him. Sounds good to me. Let's do this, guys. So we're gonna go ahead and try to catch up to that toad because he's just freaking stupid. I mean, look at this, man. Stop following me! Bro, we're trying to help you out right now. Can you not see this? Hello? Alrighty. I don't know where you went. Golly, that guy could shake a leg. Wait, what? <laughs> Good point. I'm sure we'll run into him again soon. For now, let's just keep moving forward. Alright, sounds good to me. So let's just go ahead and move forward right now. Not much going on, not gonna lie. Really not. Oh, actually, wait. Let's get this block first. That might be useful. Yeah, coins can actually really be useful in this game for purchasing uh, different items and also different gear. And I'm not saying that as if I actually know that in this game because, you know, I actually have pray uh, prayed, played like almost every Mario and Luigi game. I think the only one that I actually missed was Partners in Time, and that was the only one. Um, every other game I actually have played in the series, so pretty cool. But, um, so yeah, coins, very important, guys. I would definitely not recommend you skip those. All right, have Luigi get those. Not bad. And now we can have Mario get this. Get a nut. Busting a nut. Oh, that was inappropriate. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry, guys. I should not have said that. Yo, what do you think you're doing, boy? What do you think you're doing? Try to freaking come up to me like that. Whoa. Chill, dude. Chill. Freaking chill right now. Ooh, and now we actually have this little switching block to actually try keeping score of how many times we can hit this. This little thing, uh, just for fun, little activities right here that you can do every once in a while. And eventually it does speed up, so you got to make sure you get the timing right. Okay. Oh crap, that was terrible. Oh my goodness. Alright, but now we actually have another little uh, healing block. And let's actually go ahead and save our game. So I'm going to go ahead and save it right now. Just because. Pretty sure we're going to be getting into another huge event in the next area. So I'll be sure to do that. And then once we're done with that, I think we're going to end off the video here. So let's go ahead and get into this right now. Hello? Can anyone hear me? Look, it's a paper toad. Let's go see what a story is. Eek! Hello? A uh, Goomba? Leave me alone! <laughs> this man just dipped. He's like, oh crap. Ugh, can't squeeze through. Oh, what's the matter, bro? You're too fat? You're too fat? Yo, we can't even get in there. His flatness is pretty handy for getting through tight spots like this, but it makes it difficult for us to rescue him. Freaking Luigi right now, just going in. Dude, come on now. Get it together, Luigi. Gotta mess up everything. Jesus, man. Oh my god. Not bad, though. Alright, let's move on. So, we can actually get these little blocks over here. Pretty sure we're gonna be running into something pretty important soon, so we should keep an eye out for that. Oh, shoot, that was not done yet. We can actually still get coins from this. Alright. Might as well do this little battle right here. Why not? And now we'll be able to do some bonus damage, since we actually did land on his head. So let's go ahead and get into this. And, things about the uh, Paper Goombas, guys, is that they actually slow down when they're trying to attack you or ambush you. So, gotta look out for that. Regular Goombas will actually be a little easier to land on, since they're a little bit faster. And you can get the timing better, but, still. Paper Toads, I mean, sorry, Paper Toads. Paper Goombas are actually a little bit more difficult to kind of predict where they'll rush you, because they're kind of a little slower, and they will kind of trip you out. But, let's go and get rid of this guy first. Not bad. This guy's out of here. And now we can have Luigi. Let's actually use up that hammer real quick. Alright. Ooh, slam! And now these guys are gonna freaking try to attack me. Get out of here, bro. Get that get that crap out of my house. Get out of here. And now we can land on him. He's done. Um, let's just go ahead and jump on him one more time. Bam! And you're done. And we managed to get another mushroom from that. Great! Oh, we're really close to a level up, actually. We're actually actually almost up to the top, so that's pretty awesome. 
Let's go ahead and get that. We're gonna totally skip this guy, because, you know, that's not necessary. And now we're gonna... Whoa! Look, guys, it's me, the creeps... Wait, <laughs> it's the creeps who messed me up! Yo, even Luigi's like, what? Don't tell me you forgot already. I'm the Guma you crumbled. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it took me forever to iron out the creases that you put in my face. And I'm still looking a little folded. Anyway, what I... Wait, I meant it when I said I'd be back with a bunch of my friends. Now you're gonna pay. Oh, he brought a squad. Activating... Super. Goomba. Super wheel. Oh, my God. Oops, we said super twice. You're gonna go down. All right, sounds good to me, but... Holy nuts! Oh, Jesus! Oh, crap. Oh, we actually have to press the A button and B button at the same time really fast, guys. Otherwise, we're gonna get run over. So that's not good. Let's just go ahead and dash over right now. Oh, God. Let's not, let's not get run over today. I am not planning on, you know, getting killed right now. Jesus Christ, dude. Look at this thing. Stupid little, like, Ferris wheel-looking thing. Oh, Jesus. They're still gonna plow us over. Oh, my God. Jesus, man. This is, this is terrible. This is awful. Oh, my God. How about that? Betcha... Oh, wait. Betcha didn't think we could do something that cool. Hey, you gotta keep it together. Don't let these paperweights get you down. Oh, please. The weakest one of us is still a million times stronger than, than them. Big words, little Goomba. Almost as big as your eyebrows. Oh my god, Starlo. You gotta chill, dude. Get up, Mario. You can't lose to these guys. Hmm. We better go report this to Master Bowser. Oh, shoot. Hello? Huh? Yo. Whoa, what's happening? Youch! This man, this man's going in. Look at Starlo right now, she's freaked out. She looks like a freaking emoji right now. Whoa, look at this man, Paper Mario, getting in. Who does this little paper scrap think he is? We're gonna flatten you. What? I mean, I meant what he, I meant what I said. He could get flatter than this. Oh, shoot! He just gave him the freaking short again! And? We have introduced ourselves to Paper Mario right there. Hey, wait. That was actually Mario? Well, we've already beaten one Mario today. What's one more? Get him, boys. Prepare the ultra special, um, stomp a thingy. We really should have agreed on a name for this, guys. Whatever, we're gonna stomp you. Yo, we actually have control of Paper Mario right now. Wait just a minute. Are you the Mario that Princess Peach was talking about? Sorry, that's vague. Did you come flying out of a book recently? <laughs> Give me that thumbs up. Great, Luigi and, um, the other Mario need your help. <laughs> She's just like, okay. Alright. Oh, okay. Wow, what was that? i never seen anyone jump so high, and all you have to do is hold down Y? Yes, indeed. Say, this gives me an idea. Try stomping on them. Alright, so now we actually hold the Y button to stomp on them like that. To actually flutter up like that. That's pretty cool. You know what? One of the paper toads gave me something that could come in handy here. Here, it's a copy block. Ah... Not bad. Copy has been added to the Paper Mario's command blocks. Why don't you give it a try right now? So we're now, we're gonna go ahead and try out the Paper Block ability. Or sorry, Copy ability. And now we actually have multiple paper forms. Sweet, you made copies of yourself. From the looks of, the, uh, from the looks of things, I'd say there are about six of you right now. Oh man, that super stacking up thing was, that was our idea. And you can just make copies of yourself anytime? Not fair. Hey, it's not that simple, but if you hadn't let me finish explaining, you'd know that. Oh, <laughs> yo, she's telling him what's good. You'll have to send, um, uh, you'll have to spend a turn to make copies, but check this out. When you have copies and get, or, and you get attacked, the copies will take the damage for you. Which is pretty useful, I might say. Just remember that your copies aren't quite as strong as you are. Every time you take damage, you'll lose at least one copy. Be careful. Alright. What about my boy Paper Mario, though? Alright, so now we can actually... Flutter right there. Wait! I landed on him! What the heck was that? Alright, but now we actually are, We're limited to five copies now. Before you attack, look at the uh, touch screen below. So now they're showing us how to actually um, do this, right? If you want to put those copies to good use, watch the demo and then practice. But since I already know how to do this, guys, we're going to go ahead and get right into it. Let's do this. We're going to get right into this gameplay. Bam, boom, bam, and final right there. Final little attack. Not bad. Pow, that's how you do it. You're a natural. Three birds with one stone, okay. 
And now we can actually flutter real quick. Oh, God. And land on them right there. Getting rid of one of their copies. All right. So let's actually keep on doing this, because, you know, why not? Ooh. Ooh. Ah. E. Ooh. God, that's nasty. And that is it. We have beaten all the Goombas. It's just my luck that there are two Marios. Whatever, you haven't seen the last of me. Alrighty. Yo, wait. <laughs> what? This boy Mario's freaking out right now. I love how Luigi's just completely fine with it. <laughs> Whoops, that's too much Luigi love for our little, our little new paper friend, I'm afraid. Wow, this boy just got flattened. Oh my god. But he's confused, though. We gotta help this boy out. Paper Mario is just like, what the heck, dude? What is going on? <laughs> He's just like, no, I don't want any of your love. You confused him with the Luigi from your world, didn't you? Actually, this is Luigi from totally different. And not to freak you out, but you might want to take a look behind you, too. Oh! Yo, this boy just got freaked out. He's just like, what, dude? All right, now he's just explaining to them. Golly! Okay, okay, show me your moves. Wow! Okay, I see your moves. Oh, but Mario's got some moves. They both got some moves. Not bad. You guys are really in sync. So, Mario from the world in the book in Peach's castle. Hmm, that's a bit of a mouthful, isn't it? Huh? I should call you Paper Mario? Sounds good to him. Gotcha, Paper Mario it is, then. Alright. Here's the skinny. Here's the skinny. There are two Bowsers. Now, wait, there are now two Bowsers in this world. That means double the badness. And if those two Bowsers were to start working together, that would equal evil squared. Math was never my strong suit, but you're the general gist. Here's the general gist. The three of you have to work together to save our kingdom and help out our paper friends to get back theirs. All right, excellent. With double the Mario power, we'll have these things sewn up in no time. And now we have actually made ourselves a team! Paper Mario has joined your party. From here on out, you'll adventure together in a team of three. We got ourselves a squad, my boys. Let's go! Paper Mario can jump with Y. To make all three of you jump in another, press A, B, and Y. If you need help, just give me a holler, okay? Sounds good. <laughs> oh, he's expecting him to go second. Alright. So now, actually pressing the Y button will actually make Paper Mario jump. So, pressing all three at the same time, though, will actually make all three of them jump, of course. And I think that's going to go ahead and end off this video, guys, since we actually did a lot of stuff in this episode. Uh, I think we already got about an hour in, or almost an hour. So, thank you all so much for watching this first episode of my playthrough on Mario & Luigi Paper Jam. If you guys did enjoy it and want to keep on seeing more episodes consistently, please be sure to drop a like and also com comment down below for support. Really would appreciate it, guys. Next time, we're going to be doing some more of this game, uh, trying to rescue more of the Paper Toad since we didn't really get to doing most of that but next time we're gonna be getting to a lot of that and seeing what goes on from there but anyway thank you all again for watching and I will see you all next time peace Marquezies stay awesome